Ola Alcaldo, Tali Crabtree here with some information on some of the severe weather warnings and watches that are in place. So looking at the weather that's going on at the moment, it's mainly centred over the upper North Island. We've got this low out in the Tasman which has been spreading these bands of rain down to about the Waikato region and reaching Coromandel, just touching into Bay of Plenty. And as these features move across, there are some heavier falls embedded in here, possibly thunderstorms as well. And that is going to bring some periods of heavy rain, possibly reaching warning criteria. So this is going to be continuing over the next 24 hours or so. Looking at the pressure analysis, we've got these features spreading across the upper North Island associated with this low that is gradually sinking south. And over the areas from Northland down to Coromandel and Bay of Plenty, these are the hot spots for possibly seeing some heavier falls. So looking at what current warnings and watches are out, we do have the, a few expiring today. A, rain warning over the Hawks Bay ranges. There's a chance for a further 40 mils to fall there but that goes away this afternoon. It's For Northland we do still have that risk of some heavier falls with thunderstorms until this evening. So it's only a watch out at the moment but if those heavier falls come through they could make quite the impact. Moving into tomorrow, Coromandel Peninsula and the western parts of Bay of Plenty are the places to watch. There will be periods of heavy rain, mainly associated with those bands that are moving through. There is a chance for localised downpours with possible thunderstorms that will move through the area. So make sure you're keeping up to date with what these warnings and watches are doing. You can find all of this information along with your local forecast for these regions on our website at metservice.com.